It's winter go home time in girls lacrosse. The striped blue turf of St. Francis plays host for the Valley and Wheaton United. The two face off with a sectional semifinal against Bennett on the line and Wheaton won the previous matchup against the Valley 11-10. Wheaton sees a great early opportunity as Isabel Campos finds Addison Losey, who shoots and scores to go up 1-0 just over a minute into the match. Losey surveys the field and finds a cutting Reese Williams who fires with confidence to go up 2-0. United's been in control of the ball throughout the first four minutes. The Valley star Sophia Zymo looks to answer after a foul. She charges forward and shoots low to put the Warriors on the board. They trail 2-1 at the end of the first. Now 2-2, the Valley freshman Katie Madden looks to get the first lead of the game. She stops her spin, doubles back down the middle, and rockets one into the top corner. The Valley leads 3-2. Wheaton's Elizabeth Barnhart zips one to Reagan Curdine, who scores to tie the game at three. The match heads into halftime tied at four. The Valley takes the initiative in the second half as Sophia Morgan passes to Zymel, who goes low again to beat the keeper. It's a 5-4 Valley lead. Campos has a few tricks left up her sleeve as she runs down the middle and despite the fall, she ties the game back up at five. The game has been tied at six for five minutes now, but Zymel has new plans. She receives the ball from Morgan and fakes out two defenders to score, putting the Valley up 7-6. After the ensuing faceoff, Zymel picks up steam and fires one through the legs of the Wheaton goalie. That makes it 8-6 Valley at the end of the third quarter. The Valley collect a miss and get it to Zymel over the middle. She scores her fourth straight goal to make it 10-6. The Valley looks to end the match for good as CC Oaks passes to Colleen Clinton, who scores to give the Valley a 12-6 lead and to put the match to bed. The Valley win 13-6 and will play Bennett in the sectional semis. I feel like we were struggling on the draws and just even getting possession. They, it was 2-0 right off the bat and we didn't even get uh, a chance on the offensive side. Um, once we kind of figured out what they were doing on the draws, we adjusted to it, figured all that out, and once we were getting possession, we were able to score off of that and run our offense. I don't know, I think it's just the, it was very close, and I think that adrenaline and just the competitiveness of everybody, we just want to do better, and we want to win, um, and we want to keep going, we don't want to lose and end the season.